Assalamu alaikum. I am back with more tips for healthy eating. You've all been eating dates, I'm sure, plenty of them, particularly at iftar time. I think they're an extremely beneficial type of food, uh, which from the time of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, where he has mentioned that dates actually, uh, as you take your iftar, uh, he mentions in a hadith, in a dua, that Zahaba zamau wabtalatul uruku wa thabatil ajri insha'Allah. And it's a beautiful dua. But what it really saying is, uh, the translation of it is, that the veins are moistened and the thirst is gone by the will of Allah. And initially I was a little bit confused about what this means, but then I realized that actually taking iftar, particularly the dates, uh, gives you an immediate rush of glucose or sugar into your body. And uh, not only that, but uh, it actually gives you a very healthy amount of fiber also. So when you eat dates, you actually give yourself two things. You give yourself an immediate supply of healthy carbohydrates, sugar, healthy. Uh, but the other big advantage is that you actually give yourself uh, fiber as well. And fiber is very well known to protect the person from things like constipation, slow intestinal function, etc. So I think dates are extremely valuable and I think we should continue to do them. I use them in Ramadan. The second tip I have for today uh, in the same uh, reign is that fasting actually increases mental focus. It's quite amazing how modern research is showing that a fasting person is a more focused person. They are more capable of doing what a non-fasting person cannot do. Uh, there are of course more than one factor but the component of focus, the component where a person can clearly identify what they want to do is related to something called brain-derived neurotrophic factor, BDNF for short. So this brain-derived neurotrophic factor is released in the brain and therefore helps a fasting person becoming more able to focus on whatever tasks they're doing. So today, inshallah, these are two tips that I'd like of my audience to remember. One is give yourself a healthy dose of sugar and fiber with dates when you break your fast. Don't eat too many of them, of course. And secondly, recognize that fasting actually gives you better focus. And the reason I'm saying this is fasting is something we can do throughout the year. Intermittent fasting, right? The Prophet used to fast on Mondays and Thursdays. So let's, inshallah, adopt this habit from the month of Ramadan that we will continue to use during the remaining part of the year. Until inshallah tomorrow, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.